All right, we are back here at 513 and once again some abrupt changes to our weather. Kind of fall like out there this morning. Temperatures have dropped in the mid 30s to low 40s. It's still breezy, cool, and we're even tracking some showers. And I think we may see some of that linger through the afternoon. We're getting a little break this morning, then a couple more opportunities. Just never ends the last couple of days. But uh, either way, it stays cool and windy today. And then though we'll be breezy through the weekend, it's going to be a whole lot warmer, especially by Sunday afternoon. Outside right now, again, mostly cloudy, windy. Most of the showers have pushed east of the Missouri River, but we've dropped to 39 out at the airports. So that's down two on the last update. And uh, still quite windy with those northwest winds at about 18 miles per hour. Other temperatures looking like this. A lot of 30s showing up. In fact, everybody now on the reporting map here in the 30s. You can see Nebraska City, Plattsmouth, 38. Right now, Lincoln checking in the same way. Little cooler to the northwest. Mid-30s, Wayne, Norfolk, and Columbus. Right now, Carroll, 37. And that's a common number down the highway toward Atlantic into Red Oak there, everybody. All three of those spots at 37 degrees. All right, as we check out our weather Radar here once again. This is kind of a composite little different vantage point for you this morning. And you'll notice a majority of the rain and even some thunder and lightning kind of pushing up into central Iowa. You can see how strong this upper level low is that's driving down to the south and east. And uh, we actually still have some residual moisture back to the northwest. So though this main area of rain is kind of pressed south and east of us, we'll actually see the possibility for a few showers, even indications of a couple of flurries in the colder air back to the northeast, but you notice the coverage a lot less. We're talking a sprinkle, maybe a couple showers redeveloping here a little bit later on. All right, we'll track it on our future cast model. Kind of looks like the radar this morning. Uh, once again, the upper level part of the system continues to spin away, and then you'll notice uh, clouds kind of hanging in tough, and occasionally we might start to see a sprinkle or shower redevelop. Some of that, especially this afternoon into very early this evening. But as you head out on this Friday night, I think this would quickly come to an end. Dress warmly though, the winds stay up early this evening and temperatures will be dropping from the 40s eventually on back into the 30s. So kind of a raw forecast the next 24 hours with those northwest winds gusting to 25. A few showers out there today with a high of 48. Tonight then, rain in, skies clear, fortunately the winds diminish because we're going to drop to 35 and then our forecast for tomorrow, though it will be breezy, a whole lot warmer back in the upper 50s and check out Sunday, 76 the expected high there. Little cooler Monday back in the upper 50s, and then I still think we're in the low to mid 60s Tuesday and Wednesday. A few showers Tuesday, a little bit better opportunity for rain and possible storms Tuesday night into Wednesday. Otherwise, as that system moves by, we'll be a little cooler back in the 50s on Thursday. So, uh, though we do have a couple lingering showers in the forecast today, we're not expecting severe weather, and we'll have to kind of wait and see through the middle of next week. Either way, we start off the month of April today. That kind of gets into our more severe weather prone season, especially as we go out in time here in the next two or three months. So you can download Storm Shield to your smartphone. Once again, if we get under those threats, great way to stay ahead of the active spring like storm. That is right. Staying yeah. away, staying ahead of the action. Yeah. And we saw that action all across the south yesterday, oh, Ryan. Last couple days, Texas, yeah. Oklahoma, yep. and then yeah. we were tracking that. Kentucky, Tennessee hit yeah. really hard yeah. yesterday. So. It's still going on this morning yeah. in Alabama yeah. and Georgia. That's True. kind of the sweet spot for rough weather yeah. right now. Right. Ryan, see you again on threes. Okay. All right. Well, coming up in your morning.